And the uppercut from Edward, a punch we haven't seen him throw. And it's Beaupierre getting beaten to the punch again. He's in the gold, black and gold. Work, Daniel Edward, native of Haiti, lives in West Palm, fought in Haiti. Really in a tumultuous time just this past December. Amazing that he was there, huh? Now he's in California, swapping shot to Dorian Bopierre. Edward wants to stay unbeaten and wants to dazzle here on television. Work, work. In his first show box appearance, he went the distance against Miguel Espino. In a fight that turned into a war at times. This one, again, very spirited pace for middleweights. It is, and, and Bopierre is landing his share of shots. I don't see major improvement in Edward's defense, but he's just not as heavy-handed as Edward. Edward's a thicker, stronger guy, and I see a difference in their punching power. So how does Dorian Bopierre keep Edward off him? Not only keep off him, but score points. Well, he's just got to use his legs and walk him onto punches and then pivot and get out fast. He did it in the first round beautifully. Edward's coming forward. Land a one-two, not just the jab, as Johnny Persol says, and then, in essence, get out of town. He did. Bopierre with a glance at Johnny Persol, and then he hit Edward as solid as you can hit somebody with a right hand, right down the pipe. And Edward is taking flush shots from Dorian Bopierre and didn't even seem to wince. Let's see if Bopierre's confidence rises now. Edward says he loves to be macho and prove to the other guy that the other guy can't hurt him. Not a very good idea, but here he is coming forward after taking the two biggest shots of Bopierre's fight so far. You just gotta wonder how that didn't hurt. Hurt me. <laughs> and now it's Bopierre thumping his chest.